Welcome to Comprehensive Medical Care Services of Eastern Carolina. I'm just coming in the front door. Turn the door off. Um, when you come in, there's a, a room right to the left. And then we proceed to go into the lobby. As we walk through the lobby, um, you can see it can handle multiple chairs, but we've taken a lot of chairs out secondary to COVID. So we walk through the lobby and in the lobby, we have a bathroom that has a changing table in it. And we have nine, no, we have 10 single bathrooms in the building and two gang bathrooms. So we're coming into the room and here we have a little place where a patient can get on the computer, can, um, with, like we do a lot with mental health stuff, so they can do a, a memory screen. Here's the front desk office here. We have positions for six people to have an independent desk in the front office. Now we're continuing down the hallway with the exams. We have eight exam rooms and one treatment room in the facility. All the exam rooms look about the same. So we're moving down and we, a lot of times we're right now, we're using a lot of the spaces differently what I initially designed it for. Kind of a little meeting room. Here's the back hallway here. Um, two more exam rooms right there. Um, one of the 10 individual bathrooms. So we're walking back towards the front and we have a little workstation right here outside my office. We'll pass by my office really quick. And here we have nurses station where we have place for four nurses. And walking back around, this takes us back around to the front where we have place for six support staff. And here we're coming into the treatment room where we can do some procedures. And at the back of the treatment room, we have another independent bathroom that also has a shower. And we're walking our way through. We had a file room, but everything's electronic now, so we've been getting rid of the files and everything's on the computer. So we're getting into the back hallway here. This is one of the offices that's utilized. This room here was initially, this is kind of a storage junk room. No, it's locked. Kind of a storage junk room right now, but it does have the walls uh, have lead in them where we could put a x-ray machine. And it's got 440 current going into that room. Again, that's the back side of my office. And here we have the brains of the building. We can handle, um, 100 phone lines, and we have fiber optics, um, one gig up and one gig down uh, coming into the building. So this is kind of most of the first floor. Now we used to have an adult health daycare center. So we have a full commercial kitchen. Uh, here's another big space out here. And this is a, that leads to the treatment room right there, back to the nurse's station right there. And this area is multi-purpose area. Over here, that's back, it's leading back to the door where we came in. Here's the two more uh, individual bathrooms. We have the elevator right here, elevator room right there where the where all the equipment for the elevator is. And we're walking through. I'm gonna take you into the commercial kitchen, which we're kind of using as a storage right now. So we're walking to the commercial kitchen. We uh, no longer have the commercial stove and refrigerator and things in here, but we used to have. So we have um, a triple sink there and a double sink there. And lots of cabinet space here in the kitchen. And here is another one of the heat and air units. We have six heat and air units in the building. <clears throat> so that's the first floor. 
I'm going to stop the tape here and take you to the second floor.